Hey guys, it's Henry Branham. I'm over at the fields on Highway 1 between Lugolf and Elgin today. And uh, as you can see behind me, um, fields are flooded. From what I just heard, the uh, wreck activities tonight have been canceled, obviously, for the field conditions. That's a little bit what I'm here to talk to you about. Uh, I am actually uh, putting my name in the hat as of this past Thursday for the Kershaw County Council seat, District Number Three position. I know I'm late into the ball game, no pun intended, but I am um, been thinking about this for six months, but just committed to it a week ago. Um, I was on the fence just because of some obligations with coaching for the um, varsity soccer team this spring, work my, my job, holidays, family, things of that nature, and then I realized last week that I was actually supposed to do it. So my name is not on ticket. I'm a write-in for the District 3 seat, and I would definitely uh, love to have your vote. Um, those areas include anywhere from uh, downtown Elgin area over to Rosewalk, uh, back around toward Kelsney Ridge, um, Wood Trace, out in the Concord Church area, Dubby's Mill, uh, back around uh, all the way to 601, on the other side of 20, the southern side of Lugolf, Elgin below 20, and then back over toward Chickadee Lane, Watts Hill Road area, uh, back up to Hayes Creek. So anyway, you know anybody in those areas that is not voting or maybe should be voting, um, and they're your friend or neighbor, please share it with them. Let them know that I'm on the, um, I'm, I'm in the race. I'm just not on the ticket. I need to go tomorrow between 7 and 7. Type in, click on the write in button. Type in my name, A T N R Y Henry Branham, B R A N H A M, and uh, get me uh, some votes. I'm just trying to win the seat because I am not happy about situations like this, guys. We're going to go renovate a park for travel ball, basically. And as uh, one of the board members termed it, we're just going to see how it goes, basically. We're just going to see how it goes. Well, I'm, I don't want to be taking our millions of dollars and just kind of see how it goes, guys. I want to, we spent millions probably out here and, and soccer fields and baseball fields are flooded. They're not crowned, they're not draining properly. The roads aren't even correct. So maybe we can, uh, I'd like to get some brains in there behind the action, but we'll see how that goes. Um, tomorrow at the polls, if you go vote for me, I will say this, um, I, I am a Christian. I'm not ashamed of it. Uh, one of my favorite verses comes out of Psalm 19. It says, Let the words of my mouth and the meditations of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. And I know that as a Christian, everybody has a, you know, everybody messes up. Everybody has a, a bad past, has done things that are, that they're not proud of. And, uh, but I do intend to use that verse as my motto for this is to, to let those, let the words of my mouth let the meditations of my heart be acceptable in God's sight because he's my strength and he's my redeemer. I'm not a politician. I'm a community member making an average salary driving a 20 year old truck. I just feel like we have too many guys that are making way too much money in high up positions that are on the board that aren't looking out for the best interests of the community. So if you want someone who's an ordinary guy who will stand up and listen to you go back and represent you well, who's not afraid to push back a little bit, I'm your guy. So feel free to vote for me tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be out gathering up votes until tomorrow evening, see what we can do. It's going to be low turnout, I'm sure. It's a special election. There's only one one uh, race on the ticket. So uh, feel free to come by 7 to 7 to March, your local precinct. I only know of the Blaney Baptist precinct, but I'm sure wherever you normally vote should be open. Uh, I cannot get that information from the county for some reason or from the Chronicle. I don't know what's going on. I've asked, but kind of gave up on that. But uh, the, the town hall or the county office should know. If you need help, send me a message. I'll figure it out tomorrow. But uh, anyway, love to see you out tomorrow. If anything, go out and vote. Um, you know, we our, our forefathers fought hard for this right. I never miss an opportunity, and I hope you wouldn't either. Henry Branham, March 28th, Kershaw County Council seat. District number three. Vote for me. Thanks, guys. Bye.